Hi, I'm John Everett with Zern Industries. I'm very pleased to be with you today to introduce you to an exciting new product from the Zern Wilkins Group, and that is the ZW207 Excess Pressure Shutdown Valve. Now, this particular valve could be thought of as an alternative to a pressure relief valve. When we have uh, sensitive equipment downstream that could be damaged by high pressure, or for example, say, older infrastructure, older piping that would be very difficult to repair, all of those components and piping are going to be highly pressure sensitive and excess pressure could cause damage to them. Now, normally we would think, okay, let's plumb in a relief valve and uh, we go over pressure, we'll go ahead and just dump that excess pressure. But that also presents a few problems. For example, number one, where do we put the drainage of the relief valve? Typically, a relief valve is going to have a considerable amount of discharge. Also, we have to be concerned about the reseeding limits of that relief valve. When relief valves of the safety type open up, they don't always reseat right back at the same pressure they opened up at. Typically, they'll reseat at about 80% of that value. So those are problems that we may incur. That's where the ZW207 comes into play. We will install this valve downstream of a pressure reducing valve. And this is an adjustable valve. So what we can do is set it, oh, I'd say approximately 10 PSI higher than what our pressure reducing valve is yielding. In the event that the downstream pressure due to, relief, uh, due to pressure reducing valve failure starts to rise, this valve will literally shut off the water. So again, its intended purpose is to protect that downstream piping and sensitive equipment from going over pressure due to PRV failure. The valve is pretty straightforward. As I said, it is adjustable. It utilizes a relief pilot. And once again, we'd probably put that at about 10 PSI over what we have our pressure reducing valve set to. If this valve does uh, close off and do what it's intended to do, it will have a very small flow of water coming out of it. We can pipe that to a safe drain. And again, it's very, very little flow. It's not going to be anything close to what a relief valve would do. So anytime we have a situation where we could uh, potentially damage equipment or piping on the downstream side of a pressure reducing valve, I would strongly encourage you to look at the ZW207 Excess Pressure Shutdown Valve. Now, if you want more information on this product, certainly feel free to contact our customer care department. We've got specification sheets, we have instruction sheets, anything that you would need to determine whether or not this product would be acceptable for you. So again, feel free to contact our customer care department and ask for information on the ZW207. Thank you for watching. For more information, please subscribe to our One Zern YouTube channel. Call our customer care center at 1-855-1-ZERN and visit us at zern.com.